And here's our pork sinigang sa Sampalok. Hello and welcome to Come at Home. We are preparing uh, pork sinigang for uh, today. To make good sinigang, there are some important factors that we need to know and understand. Number one, of course, we need to have tamarind. For me, this is the best base for uh, for sour soup sa, sa sinigang. Then second, you need to have your taro, your gabi. No? And then, of course, you need to have your uh, spice. It's not so hot, it's not so spicy, but you need a little little heat, no? Coming from uh, tung finger finger chili. So yun. Siyempre, gawin natin pagkain ng, uh, pagkain ng mayaman, lagyan natin ng sibuyas. Ha? Mas mahal na sibuyas ngayon kaysa baboy eh. So, damihan natin sibuyas. Okay? Ha? <laughs> mayaman to. <laughs> and uh, our ingredients, lagyan natin ng, uh, ng radish and kangkong and uh, and uh, string beans. First, in itong tamarind, pakukuloan natin. Pakukuloan natin ng mabuti. No? And this would be our source for the, the sourness that uh, we need for our tamarind. Okay, lalagay ko siya dito. And then we let it boil. So, nandiyan siya. Okay, that's our tamarind. Pakukuloan natin yan. Tiyan ka lang. And then, Next, yung, uh, yung gabi natin, mag-ingat kayo kasi ito, medyo makat ito. No? So, when you, when you uh, peel it off, itong skin niya, medyo, makita mo, medyo may konting mga pricks, no? Uh, makat yan. So, maghugas kayo kagad ng gamay. Uh, sa kangkong natin, so this, is, this has been uh, pre-washed. Uh, oh, oh, what I want is just, uh, I just need the leaves. So, yan, ganyan mo lang yung dahon niya. Just do that. So these are young, uh, these are young uh, kangkong. So kahit may kasama siyang konting stock, okay lang yan. Kasi pakukuloan mo naman. So pag pinakuloan mo, lalambot din yan. Okay. Then next yung peel natin yung radish natin. Just like that. Just peel your radish. Manipis ang skin ng radish. So hindi mo kailangan lagyan ng uh, mabigat na pressure. Parang Parang carrots and potatoes, ganun. No? Light lang yung pressure. And always work with a sharp knife. So, make sure na sharp lagi yung knife mo to prevent, uh, to prevent injuries sa, sa kitchen. Okay? Yan. Yan lang. Yan yung pagputol ng radish, ganun lang. Yan. Ito yung uh, string beans natin. Cut it uniform sizes. And okay. Tanggal natin dulo. There. And then yung haba ng string beans natin, ang ganda lang. Regular size lang. So, mga 2 inches long. Yan. Yeah. Yan lang. Uniform lang. Yeah, masarap sa sinigang, maraming ano, maraming uh, a lot of vegetables. Why? Because this way you get your umami taste, no? The vegetables are the source of your taste for for umami. So yung savory taste ng sinigang dito talaga nang gagaling and from the pork. And then yung sourness doon ang gagaling sa ating uh, sa ating uh, tamarind uh, base. So yan. And at this point, then na tayo We'll cut our pork now. So, di tayo sa, sa pork natin. Wow, nice. Nice lab. Putulin natin just from the, the ribs, you know. Ayun yung ribs na dito. See? Oh, pag sharp yung knife mo, sandaan mo lang ng kutsilo. You know? Oh? Ganda. I love working with sharp knives. Kasi pag pinutol mo na ganito, pwede mo nga ito, no, eh. Ibabad sa suka, eh, oh. Tapos, pwede mo siyang ihaw, oh. Okay. Okay. So, next naman, putulin natin na medyo malit yung, ano, yung, ah, uh, 
yung uh, meat natin. Ha? Yun. About this size is good for you. Good. Kasi, pag niluto mo yan, delete pa ng konti yan. Kasi matutunaw ng konti yung, yung pork fat niya. Yeah. Okay. Good. Yep. Nice. So we're using about 3 kilos of uh, 3 kilos of pork today. Yan. Ginawa ko, medyo ininit ko na yung tubig natin. No? Yan. Para pabagsak ito. Yun. Mabilis na yung, yung cooking time natin. Kasi yung spare ribs, hindi naman siya matagal palambutin. Sandali lang ito, tapos salambot ka agad. Okay. Yung gabi natin. Ang gusto ko kasi, isabi ko na palambutin yung gabi. Gusto ko kasi yung gabi, madudurog sa habang lumalambot yung, yung baboy. That will make for a very thick broth. Very thick soup. So, I'm not going to put all. Kasi gusto ko rin na meron matitira na na gabi as we, as we eat it later. But, I'll put a, a number of uh, gabi into our boiling water ready para para lumambot na siya. Okay? There you go. Okay. Tapos naman, yung mga yung mga aromatics naman lalagyan natin. Okay? okay. Yung uh, sa sa pinakamahal natin na na ingredient of course pero sibuyas and bale okay magkalala soon babalik na sa tamang presyo yung sibuyas put this on the side ganyan for composting na yan tapos alam nyo in, in the Visayas in the Visayas nilalagyan nila na ano, nilalagyan nila ng um, talito ng ginger yung sinigang nila, you know? It was the first time na nakatikim ako ng, uh, ng sinigang na merong no, merong ginger when I married it to Lucy dito sa, sa Ormoc City. But normally sa Tagalog or other places, hindi nila talaga nilalagyan ng ano, hindi nila nilalagyan ng uh, ginger. But uh, today, since nakasanayan na rin natin na kumain ng uh, sinigang na merong ginger, masarap din ha? Ano yung nakakadagdag ng, ng asim tsaka ng yung tapang? Lagyan ng konti. Just a uh, little, little uh, ginger taste. Parang, yan, ganun lang. That's it. That's all, that's all the, the ginger that we want to put in. So, nandun yan. And then, of course, masarap talaga ang sinigang kapag meron ding tamatis. Yan. Gives good uh, flavor. It gives good uh, color and uh, gives you lots of uh, vitamin C. So, now na binaboil natin yung yung baboy natin, sasama na rin natin yung itong mga to. Ibagsak na yung onions. Diyan, ibagsak mo natin yung ginger. Ibagsak mo natin yung mga kamatis. Yan. There you go. Good. And then, sarap mo lang ulit. Hanggang sa kumulo lang siya na kumulo. Let it boil for about mga 35 40 minutes no and then malambot na yung yung uh, baboy mo for sure just put a little pepper yan just to give it a little taste at this point gumukulo na siya tingnan natin kung malambot na yan pag malambot na siya pwede natin durugin yung yung uh, tama rin natin yan durugin gamitin mo lang siya no yung pang mashed potato yeah that's how to do it yan so durug na and then mamaya Iyan natin, i-sisive lang natin siya. Okay? So just let, let, let boil some more. Para ma-extract pa natin ng konti yung, yung asin. So, pag uh, medyo kumukulo na siya, um, uh, yung bula-bula sa ibabaw, tanggalin na natin. Scum. Scum. Yun. Scum ang tawag doon. At this point, gagawin naman natin yung dinurog naman natin na, no? Dinurog natin na tamarind. Hmm? Uh-huy! Yan! Nothing beats a sour sinigang. Nothing beats a sour sinigang coming from the tamarind. Gusto nyo bang malaman kung gano'n talaga kaasim tong kaasim tong ah tamarind base natin ako nang titikim para sa inyo Woo! 
Okay, so we'll put in our tamarind base. Just like that. Lagyan natin lahat. Yun. And then we'll see kung talagang at this point maasim na siya. Sakto na yung asim. Wow, good. Lagyan natin ng salt to taste. Ayan. Marami. So, lagyan natin maraming salt. Then, alo yung loot natin. Pukunin ko na yung gabi. Ayan, medyo malambot na. Kasi, dudurugin natin yung gabi natin. Ayan. Ito ngayon yung magpapalapot sa soup natin. Durugin na natin siya. Ayan, ganyan lang. Okay. After 45 minutes of uh, boiling our pork, yun, ilalay ko naman yung gabi. Ayan, para ito naman yung unang lumambot. After 10 minutes of uh, boiling our gabi, so, bali sa medyo malambot niya, lagyan naman natin yung radish natin and yung, uh, uh, yung uh, sili natin. Kanina, we, uh, we boiled total of uh, 45 minutes sa pork natin. And then, nilagyan natin yung gabi natin. Give it 10 minutes, so that's 55 minutes. Plus 5 minutes sa radish natin. So that's total of about 1 hour of boiling our pork. No? At this point, kung titsikin natin yung, yung pork natin, it should be soft already. So check sa skin. Yun, no? Dali ito magus na ano, tumusot ng uh, fork. As you meet na, then we'll check. Malambot din. Yun, very nice. Okay? So, final ingredients na din, lalagyan natin yung yan, dahon ng kangkong. That's it. Sarap. Okay? And our beans. Yan. Five minutes time. That's it. We'll serve this and have our lunch. Bugun sa tubig and then cover it a little more. And we are ready to serve. Here's our pork sinigang sa sampalok. Si kung talaga malambot yung yung baboy natin yan. Malambot na. Pagin hmm? na mo. Okay, try. Hmm. 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 And then the soup. Wow, sap na asim. Para lang alam niyo. My favorite dish of all time is sinigang. Ito talaga yung pinaka favorite ko na may sabaw. Yun. At ito, paborito ko talang kainin ito na merong kanin. I love eating it this way. Tapos, mm, nahalo ko yung kanin dito. Sabaw. Tapos may konting baboy. Yan o. Oh. That's how I eat my sinigang. That's our sinigang. Cook this with your friends, share it with your family. Enjoy this, especially on a, on a cool weather like this. Okay, thank you so much. This is Richard Gomez. Thank you for joining me right here in Gong at Home. I'll see you again. Bye.